Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jeff. So in this video, we're going to check out Espa Black Mamba. Quite intriguing because of the concept. I don't know how to feel about it yet. I guess we'll see how it pans out, like the whole AI kind of thing. I know it's been mixed reviews on Twitter and um, just from K-pop fans in general. So we'll see. I think it would really all depend on the execution and how they go about this in terms of how it, they're incorporated in um, music videos and future releases. And I only know the face of Karina because I did react to Kai and Karina's Hyundai duo. So if you guys are interested in that, it is available. Okay, let's go check this out. I'm so curious as to what kind of sound they'll have. Oh. Whoa. That's Karina, she's so pretty. Damn that walk. Okay. <gasps> hey! The flower thing the, is from uh, Make a Wish. Love the aesthetic. There's also a ring to her notes. Okay. Whoa! What the fuck? Holy shit, that my, that my my legs hurt because of that. That's a big stretch. And a big drop. Oh, that's cool. That girl looks like Hold on, I'm going to rewind a little bit. She looks like a mix of Changha and Jenny. Where is she? Her. Look at that. She's like, if Changha and Jenny had a baby, it would be her. <laughs> okay. Good verse. Love her tone. Okay, there's enough different there's enough variation in the in the vocal tones, which I like. Um, there's a ring to their pitch, which is something that is good for big live stages. For example, like just listening to that at a concert, like in the like a big dome, that kind of thing, it rings. So that means that they don't need to project so hard to be heard, because there are softer voices too, right? But when a vocal tone has a ring to it, it's just it's. It just embraces the crowd. Oh, we got a snake. Holy shit, this this drop though, it's a love it. Karina's killing this too. What? Oh, this is from the teaser photos. Yes! Holy shit! It's kind of like um, a a spell. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Whoa. That is a very emotional tone. I love her. Woo! This is a pretty epic debut. <gasps> Whoa! Oh my god, I can't wait for the dance practice. Oh, it's catchy. <laughs> oh my god. Well, is this the altar verse? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, it's all about social media. 
I didn't, I didn't, sorry, I didn't look at the lyrics at all because, like, that visual is insane. Oh, we got more? So is that for the next music video? They, SM is, like, dropping clues all the time. Okay. I'm impressed. I'm, I'm very impressed. They're quite polished. Which is something, of course, that comes out of SM, <laughs> right? Where I've always said this, SM probably has the best training in terms of the agencies from what I've seen anyway. But from a performer's perspective, I would go to SM for training. It's like I'd be so gung-ho about going there because I know that my skills will level up to different heights, to things, to places that I can never imagine that my body's capable of. I mean, of course, there are other age agencies that are really good with training as well, and I feel like the most consistent is SM in terms of their groups. I think the AI thing is very unnecessary. I think the girls can make it without it. Is I, I get the whole AI concept kind of because it is the age of technology, especially with Gen Zs and um, you know uh, social media. Everything is evolving, all of that. And I, I get where they're going with this. I feel like it's gonna come to more of like merchandise. I can already see like webtoons and dolls and merch, T-shirts, movies. You know that kind of thing with those characters, with those AI characters. I get it from a business perspective, but I think for the talent that they've shown us in this first music video, I think it's unnecessary. I think the girls are talented enough to make it on their own. That freaking drop on the chorus is insane. You know how hard that is? Oh my, my legs. <laughs> Karina killed it, of course, because she you knows she's danced with Taemin and Kai already. Girls are amazing. The, I don't, the rap part didn't stick out too much to me, but I do hope that the rappers get to show the, their skills a lot more. This is a, quite a very vocally centric song, which I do like. And the girl who I mentioned um, looks like Changha and Jenny. If they had a baby together, um, it would be her. Her vocals is amazing. What a debut. Wow. Well, thank you guys for watching today. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, do like and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, make sure you tick that notification bell so you don't miss any content from me. And if you'd like to get to know more about me, do check out my Instagram and Twitter down below.